Hi, my name is Brad Agdron with Technology Services Group, and today I'd like to share some R&D work that we've done with Viva Vault in terms of allowing external applications to access Vault documents. We built a basic application that can connect to Viva and retrieve documents based on their unique identifier. And we thought that a business case for such an application would be in a training system such as success factors. So here we have a basic training slide. Um, this example is on the topic of disaster recovery. And you can see there's some high level information in the, the slide. But oftentimes, a training system needs to link to an external SOP or uh, more lengthy training materials. And that's where our integration comes into play here. This link is going to launch our uh, basic Viva Vault app. And I'm going to go ahead and open that up. And you can see it launches the document and pulls down the PDF to display to the user. Um, in our example, we also pulled down some metadata about the document as well. We have worked with some clients who cache content such as this to the LMS system using complex synchronization logic. Connecting directly to Viva allows us to always have the latest and most current document without needing to create a cache and keep it synchronized with the content management system. Um, authentication could be handled one of several ways. The application could either prompt the user for a login or potentially use single sign-on to avoid the need to log into a secondary application such as this. Providing a streamlined view such as this allows us to control exactly what the user sees and limit any potential additional functionality or actions done to the document. We hope you enjoyed viewing a glimpse into some of the R&D work that we're doing on Viva Vault. Uh, we hope you'll stay tuned and watch for future updates. Thank you.